Neither West nor guys thought they had done any wrong in spanking bare teenage girls' bottoms, and in fact West considered it not abnormal to go to pupils' homes and spank his teenage female pupils across his knee bare-bottomed in front of their parents. Although they were both actually found guilty, it's interesting to note that the justices, at the time, saw only fit to impose a fairly small fine on guys, and West walked free after receiving a short suspended prison sentence. This may be indicative that the law at that time felt that a good spanking of a bare female bottom did not do too much harm. Nowadays, of course, similar activity would quite rightly result in a long custodial sentences.